But I won't make an incision till you're nice and numb. Oh, and laughing gas can be so much fun. Please don't doubt my decision. This will be ooh, this will be ah, this will be absolutely we. This will be nice, this will be neat and bring you closer to me. So don't you squirm, don't you fight. I'm not gonna hurt you yet. I just feel the need to be getting out. Biv, mm. <laughs> Biv, we have mm. to stop. Mm. <laughs> My parents will be out here any minute. Mm. <laughs> okay. Do you think I'm overdressed? Maybe I should have gone with the mint green polo. Maybe the George W. Blue. I'm kidding! <sighs> Not cool, babe. Don't scare me like that. <laughs> babe, your mom's got a boner chime. <laughs> 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 Ah, boners. <sighs> it's hot as balls out here. I'm too sober for this. Don't worry, I know they're gonna love you. Okay, okay. Oh my god, Mom, are you okay? Oh yes, honey, I'm just fine. Come here. Please behave today, Mama. Those are some wicked battle wounds. Ah, <laughs> oh, so you must be beef. Biff, actually. <laughs> Beef, I hope you're not a vegetarian. Oh, no, not at all. Because <laughs> it took me a long time to tenderize this guy. Oh. Thigh. Just so it would be just perfect for you. Thank you so much. It's delicious. It's delicious. Great. So tell me, do you go to school? Do you have a job? I go to community college. Mm. Only the best for my Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> we are just so thrilled to have you over Beef. Biff, actually. <laughs> you know, Meg has been gushing about you over the phone to her stepfather and I for the past month. Well, I'm so glad Meg finally decided to invite me over to finally meet you. Your mother seems like an amazing woman. <laughs> How was your latest husband, by the way? I thought he would be joining us. <sighs> Frank seems to have passed out while watching the game, unfortunately. He's been doing a lot of overtime at work this week. It just didn't seem right to wake him up. Poor dear. Beef dear? Biff, Mrs. Labanac. <laughs> That's what I said. Uh, would you like for me to grab you another drink? Oh, no, no, no. I got it. And I'll get Meg one while I'm at it. I'm right here. Right. Mm, thank you. <laughs> Every lips. Did you find the drinks, dear? You forgot the drinks. Is this what you were trying to tell me? <laughs> There's a head in the fridge. What's that? There's a head in the fridge. Oh! <sighs> so that's where he was. I forgot where I put him. You saw Chuck. <laughs> yes, 
me. It is rather unpleasant to look at. Mom, we talked about this, remember? You okay? Are you right, dear? Hmm. You might be coming down with the same thing Frank has. You should eat some more. It'll make you feel better. No, no, no. I'm fine. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Tastes good? Of course, Mom. You always make the best food. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tastes so good, Mrs. Bobby. Aw, babe. You are just too sweet. <laughs> I could just eat you up. Mom! She doesn't mean it, Biff. Promise. Right, Mother? What? What did I say now? Oh! No, I didn't mean... <laughs> no, no. It's just a phrase. It's a joke. Beef knows that. Don't you, dear? Necessary. Well, of course, sweetie. How else would this mess get cleaned up? No, Mom, you ruined dinner. There's blood everywhere and you're embarrassing me in front of Beef. What do you mean? I'm sure Beef doesn't mind the mess. Do you, dear? Where would he go? Not again. saying goodbye. Not to mention the mess he left in the kitchen. Of course he left. There's a decapitated head in the fridge and he just killed Frank during dinner. And now there's blood all over the food. He probably thinks we're some type of animals, sweetheart. Now he's gone. Sweetie. And it's your fault. You're always ruining my relationships. Meg, now is that really fair? Fair? Remember Angus? What about Kobe? And let's not forget about Chuck, whose head currently resides in the fridge. Okay. All right. You're right, sweetheart. I'll tell you what. Why don't you and I go hunt down beef, kill him, pack him up, bring him home, eat dessert, and then I promise I will stop scaring off your boyfriends. I promise, sweetie. If you catch up with them real quick, I'll even let you use the chainsaw. How's that sound? <laughs> this will be fun. You'll find you're missing the point with that. That's enough out of you, and this will be ooh, this will be ah, this will be absolutely way, this will be nice, this will be neat, and bring you closer to me. So don't you squirm, don't you fret, I'm not gonna hurt you. Yet I just feel the need to be getting a little of you, a lot of bloodletting. I know the sensation you're probably dreading, but cutting it up will be so refreshing for me. 